Fractals are definitely very niche, but I've been able to take a couple of like dives in there and, and show to people the possibilities. My name is Julius Horsthaus, or Julius Horsthaus. Uh, I'm a fractal filmmaker, fractal artist. I applied for film school three times and they rejected me three times. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna learn it on the job. And then in 2013, I discovered these fractals. Fractal art is animations of mathematical landscapes. So you have mathematical formulas, and if you uh, run them through a computer, you get all these really weird and otherworldly sort of landscapes. Our Fractal Brains was an attempt to do something a little bit more poetic. I wrote this little sort of poem and I got all these uh, pieces of text in the fractals, which I think is interesting because it's a way to, to merge fractals with something else. As an artist, what you're doing is you're sort of looking for, okay, what works, how, what, works, what sort of form can you use in, in order to make a piece that's sort of more cohesive. For me, Vimeo, it's really like close to my heart because it's really my very first like of anything I've ever done. Uh, what's it is a little shots of dopamine that you get every time that you get something on social media like that. That definitely all started on Vimeo. So you just need to have little milestones, like, oh, I want to, I can get a, you know, a Vimeo staff pick. That, that's something that's maybe, and then the next one, and then the next one. It's weird because I never sort of aspired to do what I do now, so you sort of grow into it. And I think what's important is always to, to enjoy what you're doing and yet still to have the feeling that you're learning something new and that you're exposed to new challenges.